YouTube, MacHead97, and today I'm going to be reviewing the application, and probably my favorite application, Candy Bar. Now, Candy Bar is, you know, it lets you change your all your icons, as you can see that I've done. And today I'm going to be showing you how to use it, and just basically just reviewing it. Alright, so right here we have this little button that shows everything in your applications folder. Well, yeah, and I used to have over a thousand icons, but since they caught me illegally downloading it, now I have to buy it, which sucks. And if anybody else has like downloaded it off like the Pirate Bay or something, whatever, tell me if they caught you too, because this is gay. Alright, so what you do, say I want to change this icon. I'll drag this icon right there, press apply icons, and it'll relaunch the dock, and that icon will be changed. And over here, we have like your general stuff, like your eject button and your delete and all that. And right here, we have all your folders, like your, you know, your general ones, your applications, your documents, your system, and all that. And here, we have your trash your full trash, your finder, and your dashboard. And then over here we just have some sidebar icons for instance like right here as you can see my Macintosh HD is changed. So I changed that. And then we have all these these drives. Yeah, so that's cool. And right here we have your your like Macintosh HD and all your like external drives and all that. And over here, you have the ability to change your dock. But I really don't use this to change my dock. I kind of use dock library. I have a separate video on that. But sometimes when I download docs, it comes in a candy box or whatnot, and you can only use it with Candy Bar. So that is basically Candy Bar, and I have. Um, another video where to get cool icons and stuff. Uh, leave a comment if you have any questions. And yeah, see you YouTube.